Hey guys, welcome to Don't Starve. Oh, this is a good one. We've been waiting for a while for this. It's been on my desktop for days and days and days now. Just while we've been waiting for uh, Surgeon Simulator to finish. Of course, I've, I'm done with killing Bob now, so we're going to try and not kill Maxwell. Don't starve together. Oh, that sounds nice. Oh, it's a closed beat. Oh, oh, oh. Right, so we're going to go in. Let's get rid of this. That was, that was a, a rubbish start. Okay. Let's get going with Maxwell. Woo, Maxwell. So, for those of you that don't know, I think I'm going to wake up on, on uh, some sort of procedurally generated world. My main job is to just not starve, funnily enough. Um, I try and, I, I think escaping the world is high on the agenda somewhere. <laughs> Say, pal, you don't look so good. You better find something to eat before night comes. Well, there's a mushroom right there. All right, so here we are. It's a whole new world. Uh, no, someone shoot me, please. That was that was horrible. There we go. I found some food straight away. We are in and boom, done. Um, I do believe I now need some grass and stuff. Um, over here, you'll see we have this whole list of stuff. Uh, like if I want to build an axe, I need some flint and sticks. If I want a pickaxe. This sort of stuff. More importantly, if I want to build a torch or maybe even a campfire, I need some pretty serious stuff. So, like logs. Um, the reason I'm worried about the campfire is up here we've got a little timer tick thing. Um, so, when it's in the yellow, all good. I can wander around the world, everything's fine. Uh, when it's in the red, uh, this is kind of like dusk time. When it gets into the black, I cannot see and the monsters are coming to get me. So I, I want to have a fire ready by the time the black rolls round. Um, yeah, and that's basically my game plan for today. We're gonna we're gonna get get a fire going. We're gonna try, hopefully get some seeds. Maybe make some toasted seeds. Okay, so that little noise there tells me I can make stuff. Um, and now today I'm going to build the axe because I need trees for logs. I, I think that's the way it goes. Uh, mainly so I can build this fire overnight. Uh, we've got a torch at the moment. We need some logs. Oh, I don't want to pause it. That was rubbish. So we're going to go around. We're going to take down only the biggest trees because we're a responsible forester. This is how it works, right? We leave the baby ones and only take the adults. That's why we have such a small axe so that like, the little ones can make it away, yeah? That's how it works. I'm sure it's something like that. Like There's, there's, there's chopping quotas to be accounted for. Oh look, rabbit's back there. Really, well, should we attack a rabbit? Do you reckon we can attack a rabbit? I don't think we can attack a rabbit. I've like I've tried attacking rabbits in real life. Those wily things run away from you before you know what's going on. Look, watch! Ah, come here, you! I will have you! I'm chase him halfway around. How do I go, attack? Attack! Oh no, no! I didn't want a flower. Well. Attacking the rabbit didn't go well. He just kind of ran away. Should we get some berries? Berries look good. Perhaps some um, some stones as well. Uh, somewhere I have a map. Here's a map. Look at the tiny world we're living in. Let's zoom in a bit. Um, so everything we find on the map is displayed on here, which is incredibly useful. So if we ever find stuff and then lose it again, we can just like look around the map instead of having to well, instead of having to run around everywhere and try and find it all again. Right, we need some flint got some ber berries I think are going to be important we, we, we do need to not starve um, okay so grasses flints sticks twigs um, hopefully oh excuse me body functions crept up on me there um, hopefully we'll be able to find something approaching a decent campsite tonight I'm not sure if we want to put down a proper campfire um, or the like. So one of the main things we're going to need to build at some point is called a science machine. Now this involves gold, which at the moment we don't have. But once we make the science machine, which gives us access to all sorts of fancy things like uh, log suits and stuff, I think mainly, mainly protective items are what I'm interested in there. Um, one, once we've made that, it will kind of be something that goes down and doesn't really get picked up again. Which means I've got to be kind of a bit sly about where I make my work, uh, make my camp. Uh, right, let's have a look down here. What have we got going? We've got a lot of grass. Maybe grass isn't what we're... Ooh, hello. We have... Oh, poor guy. What's going on here? Indeed, better him than me. Uh, no, we don't want to do that. We want to pick up these logs. We don't, we don't need to chop down fresh trees. Oh, look, a pond. What do you reckon the pond has got to do with anything? Oh. Chopping trees take down a long time. 
It's getting late, it should be dark soon. No, no, not already. I'm not, I'm not ready yet. Let's get some more, get some more bushes. Oh, well, get some more food from bushes. Oh, so we've got a few hours of, the, of dusk. If you see up here, we've got quite a lot of red here. Um, but we do want to make sure that I've got enough time to make said campfire before uh, 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 before the night really comes. Let's have a quick look at the map. Possibly not the best time to be looking at the map. Should we go follow this road up a little bit and see where that goes? That's, I think that's probably the best idea. I mean, ideally, what we're looking for is piggy wigs. Um, there are sort of pigmen running around on this map. Uh, I've, I've seen them on other people's playthroughs. So there must be somewhere. So, oh, bees. Bees are worrying. Uh, so roads are good. Roads give you uh, a little bit of a speed boost when you're running along, uh, which is kind of amazing for exploration. That, oh, look, this this looks like a good place to set up camp, doesn't it? There's, oh, oh, look, we can zoom out to the cloud layer. Um, <coughs> so my sanity is starting to go down, possibly from running around at night. Oh, hello, what's this? Pick up eye bone. Yeah, I'll do that. Hey, what's this? It's open. Examine it. Oh. Ah. Uh, oh, Chester. Hello, dude. How are you doing? Okay, so this is good. This is um, a little bit of um, portable storage. Stop pressing escape when you mean to do stuff. Um, and portable storage is always good, especially when it follows you around. Is this the end of... Oh, God, what are these? Oh, oh, they're, they're sleeping things. I'm, I'm going to run away from those. They look incredibly dangerous. Okay, right, it's time to bust out some fire. Perhaps a campfire? Somewhere, oh, I don't know. Um, 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 uh. Ah, oh, well, we're on this side of a, a water. We're, we're going to have to... Be oh, I clicked the crow instead. Quick, do it, do it, place it. There we go. Not a moment too soon. Whew. I could have got really really bad that could have got really really bad okay so shall we have a look through what things we've got to build to make here let's go down let's have a look so we've got an axe and a pickaxe i don't i don't think we need to make the pickaxe as of yet um though if we find any gold that will definitely be a thing that needs to be done at some point uh anything else to be unlocked no all these things yeah use the science machine to prototype so we need the science machine for all sorts of stuff campfire a normal fire pit we need some actual rocks for which i should imagine we'll need the pickaxe i should imagine um in the survival traps awesome this is for trapping birds and rabbits uh, we could probably do with some of those actually um science we've got the science machine we're missing rocks and gold nuggets for that and down here oh a grass suit that might be worth it might be worth it. Oh, a spear. How do we make rope? How do we make rope? Is this is this a science machine thing? Is it the trap, compass, backpack, heart healing self? Straw roll. Straw roll. I don't see anything resembling rope. Shovel, hammer, pitchfork, razor. Shave off your dirty beatneck beard. Ooh. Need a science machine for that. So it looks like next day's goals. Find some gold. Um, oh, oh no, 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 no! I can't. I, I camped and uh, clicked in a real weird place. Garland, so we can build something to soothe our nerves, which I presume is a sanity thing. Oh, the rabbit earmuffs, straw hat. Oh, if only we had a science machine. Uh, a beefalo hat. Oh, that's nice. We need a beefalo horn. Oh, and a top hat. Okay, right. We're we're away again. Woo! Let's look at the map. Let's see which way we should go. Now, I presume all this is just water here. Now, I know presumptions are generally a bad thing to do in this sort of game, but we're we're gonna find out. Now, gold. Every time I've seen gold beforehand, it has been in this sort of tundra desert area. This sort of this sort of yellowy bit. So let's go and have a look. What do you reckon, Chester? Is this a this a good plan? Oh, maybe if we get all this grass, it will be a great plan. Max, I think Maxwell's got a bit of a grass problem, and he just doesn't seem to be able to pass it up at all. Oh, let's just grab it all. Maybe it's time to make a trap. Well, we've not got a, we've not got a campsite, so a tramp's just going to be a, a trap. Sorry, not a tramp. Yeah, let's let's make a tramp. That sounds like a good fun, right? Obviously, I mean the trampoline, the thing you bounce on. I mean, would you think I was? Oh, oh. Ooh, 
Q and E, spin the map round. Who'd have thought? Right, so we need some rocks, and with some rocks we need oh, for some rocks we need some pick, a pickaxe. So let's swap these around. Oh yeah, stop pressing escape. Um, get some rocks. We're looking for gold. What's this? Nitre. That's gonna be explosive stuff, right? Oh, we've got some seeds. Nice. Uh, I didn't make any food overnight. Which is a bit rubbish. So we got some carrots, we got some berries. Should we move all our food together so we know what we're talking about? There we go. We got some food, some berries, a pine cones. Pine cones are for planting trees. Okay, that's pretty cool. There's a nice concentration of rabbit holes here. Maybe this is the area we want to be for uh, a campsite. Oh, look at that. What's that? That's a different colour. Let's, let's try the thing that's a different colour. Oh, well, I wonder what, what explosives we're going to end up making. I mean, nitre is a, a pretty serious... Well, nitrate is a pretty serious component to most of these things. Pong, 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 pong. Come on, gold. None of that's gold. So we go, need to walk around and look for shiny rocks. Where are we going to find shiny rocks? Uh, there's a non-shiny rock. Maybe the map will show us some rocks that aren't shiny. No, I literally cannot. can only see to the edge of the map. So we're just going to have to kind of wander around. I'm not sure whether the fact that we've got some rocks means we're going to find some uh, some gold anywhere. I don't know if those two are like, you know, because one spawns here, the other would... Ooh. Ooh, what's this? I'd like some poo. I don't know whether he's an angry man or not. He's so hungry. Oh, he, wow, he is so hungry. Um, do you reckon we can make it till tonight? Oh, look, sticks and, and a grass suit. Oh, look at the... That's, sorry about this guy. I, I need to grab all your stuff. Oh, wow, he just puts it straight on. That's, that's nice. Okay, I think I've run out of edge of map to run along. Yeah, I, I, I have. So, I am picking up a good supply of poo. I mean, who doesn't want buffalo poo? Buffalo poo, I suppose. Not buffalo. Ooh. This could be very dangerous. Now, I hear these things can be pretty pretty aggressive at times. Uh, I have definitely seen people die from, from a beefalo attack. Still no gold. And it's kind of really much what I need at the moment. Um, I don't know where else I would find any. So let's just carry on walking north. Because uh, why not north, eh? I'm sure we'll find an edge of a map at some point. Though this this sort of tundra bit has been going for a while, right? It's been going for a while. Um, so tonight what we're going to do, I think, is cook up our carrots, berries and seeds. Because that, that means they last a bit longer. That said, they're not really going off yet. I could probably eat a pepper or pet do. Do they do any hunger? 37... 37 now. Okay, so petals don't do hunger at all. Okay, so now... Oh, look, this guy's got some rope. Let's, should we camp with this guy? He cannot carry any more stuff. Okay. Uh, so, let's make a campfire. Right here. Okay, Chester. Uh, do you want to... How do we cook it? No, cook. There we go. I'm going to cook some carrots and we're going to eat these. Uh, right click to eat. Oh, that is nowhere near good enough. Okay, uh, let's open up Chester. Right, what's this? A torch? Why do I have a torch? Oh, well. Let's put the poo away. I don't think we need to need the poo. Uh, Niter, I don't think we need that immediately to hand. Uh, axe. Yeah, we, I'd like the... Oh, wait. There's two axes now. Can we? Can we put these both on? I don't know. Uh, we've got a torch that also goes up that end. Pine cones. I think we really just need to start planting these, right? Just wander around, make a small small forest here. How close are we to night time actually hitting? I think we're going to end up eating all our berries tonight. Last one. There we go. Brilliant. Now we can pick up all this rope. And with rope, I believe we could do something quite funky. I can't remember what it was. I wonder if we can dig up the skeleton with a with a shovel. All right, so it's time to just sit around at night again. Um, we, we've got a campfire. We've got stuff like this. What's in the survival? We can make a trap. Eh, eh. We've got a grass suit on. Oh, it's going to just be a night of slowly toasting my berries. Uh, right click. 
No, left click. Awesome. And maybe this berry goo will see us through the night. Maybe we can get some last minute grass tufting in. Hopefully. Hopefully. Just to fill up some time before it gets actually dark when I do have to sit there and do stuff at the campfire. Quick, quick, let's do it. Am I too far away? Am I too far away? Is it a gamble? It's a bit of a gamble, but let's come on down. Let's come on down. Sweet. So we're now into a second stack of grass. So I'm going to stop trying to pick up grass. It seems a little bit redundant. Wow, that... Oh, that fire. Oh, that fire. Quick. Um, oh, oh no. Light. Campfire. Uh, do it. Okay, so building my campfire so early, not a great thing. So we've got some ashes. What can we do with the ashes? What can we do? All that's left after fire has done its job. Yeah, this is true, but what, what is needed for... Hmm. Log suits, sleep darts, fire darts, blow darts. I don't think we want any of the darts or the bee mine, though. I noticed there's a lot of um, empty space on this here. But anyway, I think this seems like a good time to say thank you very much for joining me for my first two days of this adventure uh i will see you next time when we're going to do another two days i think we'll do this two days at a time it seems like a good sort of um time span to be doing things let's let's just cook up some berries while i'm talking about this uh next time we will definitely be going out to find gold May, uh, the moment we find some gold we will set up a proper campfire somewhere uh one of one of these businesses that needs more rocks okay so we're gonna go around we're gonna find rocks we're gonna find gold we're gonna set up a campfire and we're gonna be safe so yeah thank you very much i will see you then when we're gonna do that bye